The following program is rated TV MALSV. It contains strong language, sexual situations, and violence. It is intended only for mature audiences. It's about to get lit in here. Sandra Moon Young in a hungry here at the Diamond Cup. We'll see if she can pull off what I would call an upset here. We're getting set in the road right now in Tampa, Florida. You guys, if you've never been to a GCW show, this is definitely one not to miss next year. But man, oh man, Alyssa, this is a match if I've ever seen one. Honestly, Sticks, I am so excited for this match. For Sandra Moon, Heather Monroe was someone that she has had a handful of matches with, all very crucial, very early matches in her career as a competitor. Sandra Moon has really, I mean, tested her chops against Heather Monroe and, and really said before this match that she wants to prove to someone she considered a mentor everything that she has learned and how far she has come. If you're going to do it, you're going to do it here at the Diamond Cup, that's for sure. Both these ladies, two strong lockups in a row. Ref Julie forcing the break after they back into the corner. Lockup number three. Standing side headlock here. Moon trying to bring Monroe down to a knee. Does in fact. Nice hammer lock there. Wow. Agility from Monroe, someone who's been really getting her name out there all across the country, traveling to, from, here, there, everywhere in between. Nice. A really fierce competitor is Sandra Moon, though. Look at this lock up here. Nice shoulder lock there. Twisting up the Killer Bay, but Killer Bay has a little bit, I'd say, extra fire for herself because Killer Bay, as you know, is someone that took Queen Aminata to her limits. <laughs> And she wants that redemption. She wants an opportunity. Look, Look at this. Look at this Indian deathlock here. Beautiful move. Really impressive. You can see Heather oh, Monroe. Oh. Moon reverses it into, looks like a modified cross face. Oh, truly testing the flexibility of the killer bay is Sandra Moon. And these two competitors haven't faced each other in years, but could it? Oh, I didn't think it could end that quickly. What a crazy sequence from these two. You can tell they know each other very well. Moon now backing Monroe into the corner. Moon yeah, trying to force a break. Moon doing the right thing. Moon is someone who is making her GCW debut here tonight. You only get one chance to make a first impression. Imagine making that first impression by advancing oh, in the whoa, Diamond Division. Quick, quick high stack. Wow. Smart. Oh, kind of roll. Trading pinfalls here, these ladies doing their thing. Oh, another one floats over. Oh, but shifts the momentum. Oh, great minds think alike. I think both looking for the arm drag and they're taken down. Really a, a stalemate with how well these two know each other. I'm loving this chess match here. Reversed into the corner goes Monroe. Sandra Moon was battling in full head of steam. Missed. Nice arm drag there from Killer Bay. Return one for Moon. Oh no. Wow. Moon taken all the way across. And a another arm drag for Heather Monroe's trouble. I love basic chain wrestling. It's one of my favorite things about this business. And these ladies are putting on a clinic. Got a little, oh no, now Sandra Moon introducing Heather Monroe 
goes face to the turnbuckle. Sandra now perched up top. She is ready to rain down on the killer bay. Oh, that's just assault. That's not even appropriate. That is ferocity, Sticks. That is doing what it takes and adding a little space dust to it. Space dust? Well, from the subspace division. You got to buy oh, no. that on the Cover. corner? Cover from Sandra. Sandra Moon so much on the line right now, representing S4TB, a group that's all about the, the misfits, the people that haven't found a place they can find and see themselves all in pro them, wrestling. All of them definitely are misfits. Well, I mean, I mean, pro wrestling is for everyone. Sandra Moon's here to prove it. Is it? Are you sure? Absolutely. I mean, they let you in here, so I guess so. I suppose so, but... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, but I was... Now Sandra Moon barreling into Heather Monroe with those shoulders. Just think about all of the all of the matches, all of the challenges, all of the experiences that these two competitors have had since the last time they faced, which is with championship wrestling back in 2019. It has been years, and look at this. Oh my god. Inventive, brutal submission from Sandra Moon. I don't even that's just pain. I'm gonna call that pain. Oh no, now taking oh, the cover. shoulders down. And that's just the thing, weaken Heather Monroe and then get the shoulders to the mat, hoping that Heather Monroe couldn't kick out. It's a great strategy. It didn't pay off for Sandra Moon. Nice, look at that arm drag. Oh my gosh. Go for the Monroe. bar, go for the arm bar. I have to say these submissions aren't something we're used to seeing from Heather Monroe. She's been doing little tweaks to her training over the past couple months. Look at the violence with the slap trying to break that grip. The violence is still oh. there. Never oh, leaves. Oh, I'm here for it. Oh, cover, high stack. Yeah. Wow. What a kick. Boot to the dome. Moon might be in a galaxy here right now. Cover from Heather Monroe. Isn't enough. Isn't enough to take it down. you got to imagine the kind of frustration that must be mounting. Heather Monroe, I, I don't want to say that she overlooked Sandra Moon, but I think she's used to a certain Sandra Moon, and that is not the Sandra Moon that is standing across from her. Cartwheel elbow there, that was beautiful. Heather off the rope, sweeping through. Hip check, straight to Sandra Moon. Oh my God. Subspace Sweetheart is in danger. Oh, I thought that could have been it. Now with the body scissors. Smart, keeping control of your opponent. Monroe in charge. No, Sandra Moon, though. Oh, oh, no, no, no. No, that just made it worse. Extra damage bearing down on the neck. Is this it? Is this where Sandra Moon calls it quits? Modified half Nelson from a leg position. Beautiful. Quick escape, though, from Sandra Moon, but has enough damage already been done to the base of the neck, to the spine of Sandra Moon. Oh, oh excuse I'm me. So, so impressed by Monroe's progress here. From the last time I called her in her matches, she's definitely been on the mat training, doing work with submissions, locks, all kinds of good stuff. The submissions in this match have been insane. The slaps in this match are nuts. The strike game of these competitors is staggering. And speaking of staggering, Heather Monroe staggered onto the ropes, taken down. Of some space, sweetheart, by lightning in a bottle. Can it strike here at GCW? That's a back, back elbow strike and a forearm strike. Oh, oh do you God. hear that? Jeez, just step over oh. with a kick. Back and another kicks. one. Three. Oh, she went caught for caught by three Heather. Piece, got caught. Basement drop kick to the midsection. Would that be a based meant drop kick? Hey, I see what you did there. <laughs> You're doing all right over there, kid. Appreciate you. Now off the ropes comes Heather Monroe with a low cross body. Scoops up. Sandra. Not enough. Not enough. Both these ladies this. doing everything they can to win. I love it. You've got a whole night of this. A whole night of this, but our competitors have a whole night of this, too. We, we talk about the damage that's being inflicted in these first round match. And what does this mean for whoever does advance? It means... Stiff competition, yeah, for sure. Stiff. Key word. Uh-oh. Oh. Caught by Sandra. Oh. And the Cover. bed driven down. No. Jeff Julie says two. Oh, my gosh. And 
Sandra just had fistfuls of Heather's hair. But Heather's planting herself. You can see her arms wrapped around the back of the hamstring of Sandra Smart. Moon. Smart move there. Moon was going for a gut wrench suplex. Catches the strike, but now, oh, could be looking for Moonstruck. But now, up on the shoulder. Oh, my God. What a nice sit down. Into a cover. Oh, my God. There is something in, in the air. Sandra Moon said the stars had a line, and maybe some, some fallen stardust is, is what's pushing Sandra Moon through this matchup. Well, there was a full moon the other night, so there might be an, uh, a, a foreboding, ominous sign, if you will. Oh, but is the cosmos in favor of Sandra Moon? Steps through. Uh -oh. Hooks her up. Action here, and this is only the first round. I would never have kicked out of that. Never in my life. That's incredible. This this crowd knows what they're seeing. You hear it. This is awesome indeed. You can truly hear the appreciation that the crowd here at GCW has for this first round bout. That was incredible. Both these ladies spent. Monroe on her back, Moon on her feet, but just barely. Oh my gosh, and now Sandra Moon is, no, no, no. <laughs> Do it again. Does, does Heather Monroe have enough wherewithal? Oh Look how God. low Heather's planted herself. Smart, rolls her through. Oh. Kick to the side of the head. Clips Sandra Monroe, and now Heather Bay looking for that. Baby T. This is this it. Is, this has got to be it. Hook Heather Monroe. Leg. A crazy first round matchup. Heather Monroe moves on, but you gotta believe Miss Moon has made an impression here at GCW. Ladies and gentlemen, the tournament continues.